Hey guys, it's Deep to the B here. Um, and this is about the future of the fan films. Um, and we're gonna talk about um the last two and more films that are coming out. Um, so let's get the last three addressed before we start with the new ones. Um, the last two for this year are going to be well, the one that's finished right now, besides the last one well, almost finished, is Ironhide 3 um, Greatest Warrior which hopefully we just have l cs lines the film will be all put together need to work on the credits a little bit and then the film is done um and that's about it for Ironhide 3. So expect a trailer sometime today or tomorrow. And then the film that's in production right now is Thundercracker 2 Rise of the Seekers. Or Fall of the Seekers or The Last Seeker. I don't know. It's a prequel to Evac's sequel. So... That is probably going to come out sometime later in July or maybe even August. I'm not sure yet. Just depends. Um, so that's and then Evac Four, as we confirmed already in a trailer, uh, the trailer has been already released. There are going to be some things I'm going to change, like the credit styles, to show that the credits have improved. I. Tell me in the comments if you actually like the new credits for these fan films. Um, Alright, that's not the main topic. Now you're wondering, is there going to be a volume 3? Yes, unfortunately, but there, there will not be that much, I'm hoping. Some of it may be... Some of the films that I will probably put into production and release on YouTube during breaks for school, like... Um, like, Halloween break, if I have any time. Well, actually, no, there isn't a Halloween break, unfortunately. Um, Christmas break, Thanksgiving break, um, maybe Memorial Day break. I'm not sure. I haven't figured it out entirely yet. So, expect two films to be out, or three. I'm not sure. I'm just not going to be working on them a lot during the... the school time so you're probably wondering now what's the next films in production I got my phone here for the list now I will read them off right now for the films that we have for suggestions for volume 3 are right now a mixture between characters that didn't exist in the Michael Bay universe but we added in the fan films and characters that were in the Bayformer. So anyway, let's continue. The first suggestion we have right now is a drift movie. Maybe. It just it just depends, to be honest, because if those who were on my channel a while ago, if they knew around September, I already tried something like that, but the film looked so bad that I even removed the trailer for it and deleted everything from that project. Next is Hound, which a Hound film can be possible, maybe. It would mostly probably be a Cybertron film or a mixture between Cybertron and how he landed on Earth. But the others, I'm not sure yet. Another suggestion is Crosshairs. Um, it could work, but I'm not sure yet. Just depends what we write on. Next is Dino 3, which if Thundercracker 2 is finished before the end of August or before um, the end of July and before my break that I'm having, my vacation, this guy, uh, Dino, not Thundercracker, 
His third film may be released and in development a little bit early, just depends when I finish Thundercracker 2. And then we got a Dirge film. Yes, he was in a few of the films. He's actually going to be in the last one as well for Volume 2. And possibly Thundercracker 2. But anyway, then here's one that I had strong opinions about, which Elta C thought, um, Jazz 2. I keep telling him, how would that physically work? He wants it to take place during the first Transformers movie. Like, how? It wouldn't make any sense. It... How would we make that work? But who knows? We're smart. We can figure something out, I guess. Then here's one that may be a possibility. Uh, Megatron 2, Search for the Allspark. Um, then the next one is Blackout. Maybe. It just depends if I get a toy of him. And if we can think of a good story. Then next is... Um, Springer, which Springer was already in some of the films. He was in Wrecker's sequel. He was in Thundercracker. He's going to be in the last one for a little bit. So he's been in there already. Um, then this one has already been destroyed. Originally, there was going to be one called Unicron, the last Transformer story, but I took that one off. And then Transformers, as I said before, Transformer. Did I say that before? No, never mind. The last one will be Transformers Return of Unicron. And I'm going to see if Sans Trap can make that one. But that's it. That's all we got. There's not going to be that many films. So expect some films to be in development and released. Um, in September or November or December just depends my schedule it has been really hard to make these stop motions I have currently three jobs right now and it's hard to juggle them all right now so eventually when it gets closer for me developing volume three I'll decide which ones stay and which ones go. And as I said, Dino 3, <coughs> Thundercracker 2 is already finished. We'll be get, get done immediately. So, this is D to the B out. Tell me in the comments what you think of these um, and stuff. I'm just going to go. And I'll make sure to put the whole franchise in a playlist. So, if you want to catch up, figure out the original Jazz film or the original two Dino films. So, yeah, this is D to the B, out. Bye.